Here we are, home sweet home. Hello survivors, Faction 43 Gaming here. We are playing 7 Days to Die on the Xbox. If you've been watching the last few episodes, we have been out on the road at the armored truck located in Perish Town. We are now at the compound base, back at home. I've been back at home for a couple of days now, just doing a few jobs here and there. And I think what I'll do before we go into the base, I'll just do a bit of a recap on what's been going on and then when we get into the base I'll show you a couple of projects I've been working on you'll notice the date is 209 that means we have a hard night in between 203 and this is a bit of action for me. doing a lot of farming and some trading shit man I treat you that good and you don't even fucking tip me and it's good to be back here at the compound base after being out on the road for a few days there's a lot of work that still needs to be done here. It's still very much work in progress. And there's so many more things I would like to add. So if you stick around, we'll see what else we can fit in. If anybody wants to see any certain types of builds, just let me know. We can always try them. And I'm just going to park here in the guest parking area at the moment. Um, the bike's full of loot, which I know I need to put in the guest area. So we'll just leave that there, shut those doors. As we walk across the compound, I can see there's a hell of a lot of farming still to be done. The farming that we saw earlier was in the restricted area. That was the mini garden. So a hell of a lot to be done. And just going across the river here, I want to show you the new projects I've been working on. Okay, so this is the vehicle area, and you've already seen the truck. Now, the latest vehicle is this helicopter attempt. Now, bearing in mind, this is all on survival mode, and we're playing on the console, so we are working with what we've got. And this is my version of a helicopter. For those of you who have not seen the truck, you can look back at previous episodes where we have the armored truck out on the field, and also the original compound base tour, which goes through the truck in detail. Now just going up here into the helicopter. And yet again, I find myself as I'm doing this video, I can never get up the ladders. It never happens when I do it privately. It is typical. It's quite embarrassing, really. Okay, so in the helicopter you've just seen, we've got the storage area and seating area and the cockpit. Not much really in there at the moment. I don't know what else I can put in. Now, moving on here is the 4x4, I guess, the Jeep. And we've got the two seats in here. And we've got the hatches there for the doors. And no, you can't, you can't sit in the seat, unfortunately. And we've got the lights at the front there. And going around to the back, we can get it in the back of the trailer. And if you need to, duck down. Nobody can see you. So that's the third vehicle of my little vehicle area of builds that I've got going on. Got a bit of light in there, so you can see them. You can even turn out the mining helmet. 
You can still see. And I'm just going to take this opportunity to take a little photo up for the channel. Moving on from the vehicle area straight into another project. This is the subway and the subway train we have. Now, basically, this was just a big hole that I was using to mine. And I thought to myself, well, I've got a big hole here. You know, what can I put here? It just made sense, really. So here we have it, the train. Going through here now is what you probably call the first class area. And now into the driver's engine. It's a shame, really, you don't have the computers in survival mode. That would look kind of cool. Uh, unfortunately, that's just on creative mode. Now, looking from the front of the train, you can even turn out the light and you get a nice view across the platform. I'm going to leave this video here. I've got a lot of work that needs to be done within this base, a lot of grinding, so I will do all that off camera. So I'm going to keep it short and sweet. Thank you for watching, and if you like what you see, please subscribe and give me some feedback in the comments section. That would be great. Thank you.